Viral star Sahar Tabar, aka Zombie Angelina Jolie, who is currently in jail for her Instagram posts in Iran, has reportedly contracted coronavirus in prison, according to her lawyer. The head of the prison that she is being held in says otherwise. What is gravy? You guys are watching Inform Overload. I'm Charla Dobre, and yes, I'm wearing pajama pants. On this channel, we tell you about what's trending, so subscribe if you need a place to get your news, and follow us on social media so we can connect outside of YouTube. The last time we heard about Sahar Tabar, it was about her getting arrested and put in prison over crimes of blasphemy and inciting violence. I haven't really heard about the specifics, but she did post some stuff on her viral Instagram account that might not have been okay in a place like Iran, when it would constitute as freedom of expression in the United States. She had hundreds of thousands of Instagram followers who were subscribed to her content, which usually featured heavily edited photos and makeup tricks. Despite what the media said about her having 50 surgeries in order to look like Angelina Jolie, that is incorrect. Most of what you saw on her Instagram account was the result of makeup and Photoshop. Basically, officials in her country, Iran, caught wind of her viral internet personality, and they charged her with promoting violence, illicit education, blasphemy, insulting the Islamic veil, spreading hatred, and encouraging youth to commit corruption. They put her in prison for these crimes and made her apologize to the entire country on national television, and like her face was all blurred out. Since then, she's been in prison. And according to her lawyer, she has contracted coronavirus. Payam Darafshan wrote an open letter to Iran's Judiciary Committee that he posted on his Instagram account. In this letter, he said that he was told by Sahar Tabar's mother that she had been moved to a quarantine section of the prison after displaying symptoms. He also said that she was a minor when the crimes were committed, but she hasn't been eligible for temporary release because her case was still being processed. Her lawyer also told the Center for Human Rights in Iran that she is currently in a hospital on a ventilator fighting for her life. She became sick with COVID-19 while in state custody. The head of the Shara Reyes Women's Prison in Iran, Medmi Mohami, said the news released by Sahar Tabar's lawyer isn't true. Her lawyer responded by saying that it is normal for the authorities to deny everything. The stats also back up the claim that it could be very possible that she has coronavirus. Iran has the highest death toll out of anywhere else in the Middle East. As Figures announced on Saturday, the toll reached more than 5,000. 5,000 reported cases, but the real number might be much higher than that. As for the prison system, Iran has released over 85,000 prisoners. The judge overseeing the case rejected numerous pleas to release Sahar Tabar under the same amnesty that was granted to other prisoners. Her lawyer said in his letter, we find it unacceptable that this young woman has now caught the coronavirus in these circumstances while her detention order has been extended during all this time in jail. Honestly, I don't know the specifics of why she was put in jail. That was never released to the public. Honestly, it blows my mind that her viral persona where she edited photos of herself and put on makeup, put her in prison, and now because she's in jail for these crimes that would have been considered freedom of expression in the West, she has coronavirus. On behalf of IO, our hearts go out to Sahar Tabar during this very difficult time, and we hope she recovers fully. That is all I have for you on that, and thanks for watching IO.